Hey guys, this is Andre and I'm the head of development for FlixPress.com and I'm going to demo a little new feature that we added to solve a couple, a couple of problems that you may have um, with using our service and downloading the files. So just a little background, um, we allow you to render high-end 3D animation into these MPEG-4 H.264 files. So, um, as you can see, they play by back fine in browser and if you have Windows 7 uh, operating system or Windows Vista they should play back fine as you download and open them in uh, Windows Media Player. So now the problem becomes when you actually download them and you don't have Windows Media Player uh, the latest version so if you use Windows XP or older version of Windows Vista or if your player defaults to like uh, QuickTime so then when you open them or save and open them you will see that uh, this error will show up and it says an invalid sample description was found in the movie and uh, we are aware of the problem and uh, it's a quick time problem with not recognizing the audio that is encoded so originally uh, we kind of created uh, our service so you can download and uh, download that movie and without reconverting plug it into your website so obviously if you want to edit it um, we uh, created this um, new tool for you so uh, to access the tool it's right here this gear icon to the right so just click on it and you, you, you'll have two options convert to MOV and convert to WMV so if you're on the Mac systems or if you have some higher end editing like uh, I don't know Adobe Premiere Pro so you can uh, you can actually convert to MOV and just use that but if you would like to use something like Windows Live Movie Maker obviously convert to WMV and just download it and use those um, in your uh, uh, Windows uh, Movie Maker so I'm just gonna walk you through this convert and that's it just download the file and uh, now when I open it up in the QuickTime player you can see that uh, plays back fine with uh, audio and everything. So you, you can plug it in into Final Cut, Cut Pro, iMovie, or just use WMV version uh, in uh, Live Windows Live Mo Movie Maker. So okay, that's it. Uh, hope hopefully that will help you out, and uh, we thank you for all the support so far. And we ask you to continue to support us by either purchasing a little bit of credit or, or if you use the free content, just mention us in your videos or create tutorials or whatever. Just, uh, just spread the word and uh, like us on Facebook or uh, subscribe to our channels for uh, more updates and more videos. All right. Thank you so far. You guys are awesome.